In the previous videos, we have started discussing on filing at the folder and we solve our class arachnidas. And in today's videos, we will talk about the class Maria folders. So without further ado, let's get started. Maria folder. These are many putets, vary in number from 10 to 750. They are land animals. They are land animals that are found under logs, rocks, and in the soils. Body consists of head and a long trunk. Simple ears often presence. True compound ears sometimes is absent. Sex separated. And especially by trachy. Example of Maria ports are centipede and millipede. We will talk about these two main classes of Maria ford right now in a summary. Centipede. These are also called cilipoda, commonly known as centipedes. Cilipoda. Let me say class cilipoda is also called centipede. Body is tall, serpentinely flat, and trunk segment numerous to 15 to 177. Each trunk, except the last two, bear the feel on the legs. Each trunk, have a, uh, except the last two, has a legs. First trunk bear a maxillifid. A maxillifid is a poison claw which used to kill it is a prey. That is, they use maxillifid to use to kill it is prey. And genital on the posterior end of the body. They have a genital on the posterior. They are carnivorous. Move by, move very fast. They can move very, very fast. An example is Lesobius and Scotegera. Then we talk about the next class that is Mexilifites. These are also called class Diplopoda, commonly known as Melipites. There is no appendage on the first trunk segment. Gent uh, let me see, genital pore is on the third thoracic segment. They are sluggish, are often coiled when disturbed. Each body segment with two pairs of legs. First four segment represent thorax. So these are the differentiation between centripede and millipede. Centripede is also called cilipoda. Millipede is also called diplopoda. And genital type, a genital is on the third thoracic segment. While under centripede, genital is on the posterior end of the body. So then the next we will talk about a example of centipede and millipede. As you can see here, there is a centipede. It has a, a segment body with a pair of legs. As you can see here, why millipede is typical here? This is just an image of some differentiation between centipede and millipede. But that will be in our next video. Thank you so much for watching. Do have a nice day. See you next class. Bye.